In this video, we will see how to apply this table and do it in Microsoft Word. First, uh, we need to know how many rows and how many columns. Here we have eight rows and seven uh, and uh, one, two, three, four, five, and six columns. So I need uh, eight rows and six columns. So from here, insert table. I need eight rows and six columns. I will change the size of table now let's start first for the I have here these two cells I need to merge and remove borders top and left so I will merge this, these cells from here layout merge from design I will go to border and shading make sure apply to cell and remove the top and left borders I have more removed them next for the first row I have merge all columns and I have border for, uh, same border at top bottom left and right shading with pattern and days centered so uh, so our first step I will merge the cells align with middle I will type days I will make it bold I will increase the size also from border and shading from here border and shading I will choose the style of border I can I have the same style as the top bottom left and right I will choose the style I will choose the uh, color also I will apply a directly a shading with pattern I will choose the color of pattern and I will click on OK now I applied the style of first row second I have Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday and Friday so let's do them and also I have this style of border we will apply it so now uh, first here I need the uh, bold uh, align is middle uh, let's increase the, the size a little bit I have Monday Tuesday After I added the text, now I will change the border style. Uh, all what I need is to change only the border style. For the border style, I will select these cells from uh, design, border, and shading. Uh, first, I have for the border, uh, I have the waved, uh, waved border, double waved border at the left, right, and bottom, and single waved border between. So. Uh, first step apply to cell I will choose a uh, uh, double wave border for the double wave border with uh, I will change the color I will apply it at the uh, uh, left right and bottom and single wave border with red color in the line in between I will click on ok like this this I applied the border like in the picture I can from here increase the size of the cell for these two cells or to I can decrease okay now uh, let's continue with the picture uh, I will do the last column for the rest column uh, I have uh, shading black and white pattern shading so I will select the last column I will increase the size a little bit more Now, I will select the last column from here, border and shading. I will go to shading. I will choose the color uh, white and pattern, uh, color black. I will choose the pattern. I will choose, I can choose any pattern I need.
now I applied the shading uh, at the last column now uh, I will do the first column I have a timeline uh, green shading uh, and the double and I have double border so for the first column I will select the cells first step I will add the border and shading apply two cells I will make sure yes I choose these cells only border and shading for shading I will choose the uh, green shading for the border I will choose the uh, uh, double border I will choose the uh, color and I will choose ok I applied the cerium and uh, now I will type the timeline for example from A to uh, 9.15 I, I can directly for all cells uh, make the size uh, make the font uh, bold I can also change the, I if you notice I have uh, if you notice I have uh, changed uh, text direction so I can change the text direction and make the alignment middle and center so align middle and center and I will change the text direction now let's continue I will add the rest of the timeline Uh, after uh, I, I adding random, uh, I will adding uh, all this uh, timeline. Now I finish it uh, to adding the text. I will change the text color. Only what I need now is to change the text color. So I will select these cells also. And from home, I can change the text color. Now I change the text color. Uh, let's continue uh, I will make it more dark okay now let's continue with the cells uh, here I have no nothing to do here I have CSI 200 introduction to computer but I have uh, noticed that uh, I need to uh, one and half a cell so to, to do it I need first to split this cell into two cells so to do it uh, first step, uh, I will this cell. I will go here to uh, layout, split. I will split it to two rows and one uh, to two to one column and two rows. Uh, now I will match these cells. Yeah, I, now I have one at the half of a cell. Uh, next step is to add a shading and uh, the text. Uh, for the text, I have. Uh, to rotate uh, CSCI 200 introduction to computers uh, I will make it uh, bold I will add uh, a shading to the cell to add a shading to the cell i will go to the design uh, because it is a normal shading from here i will choose the shading color here also i will split uh, this cell again to two cells to two columns and the second column i will split it to two rows so let's do it uh, now i will go to here i will split the cells into two columns one row and this uh, cell I will split it to uh, two uh, to one column and two rows uh, here I need to change the border uh, as it in the picture 
uh, it's correct yes it is correct I will type here break uh, I will make it uh, bold uh, color uh, red and for the line uh, align here I have uh, I have a and B so I will type here a and B now uh, I did these cells for these two cells I have nothing to do now in the last row I have to merge these cells and add no classes so I will go here to the last cell I will merge select these cells I will merge I will add uh, no classes uh, I will make it bold from here I make it bold from layout uh, it is aligned uh, center and bottom bottom center also I have to add a shading from here I can add a shading the shading I need I will increase the size of the text a little bit uh, I will change the color now I did the last row let's uh, move to this column I have word exam sample and revisions word exam samples and revisions with pattern uh, and with pattern uh, and shading and border uh, top and uh, bottom different uh, from the right side I know borders uh, so let's do it uh, first step I will merge these cells I will merge these cells from here layout merge cells uh, I will type word samples word exam samples word exam samples and revisions uh, I will choose first step I will rotate align uh, middle I will increase uh, the size uh, after that uh, I will change the color to red also I can change that to times in Roman for example uh, also I have uh, to add the borders and shading for the borders and shading I will go to design border and shading I have uh, the top border will not be uh, modified My bottom border I will not be changed single line I have to add red and blue border at top and bottom at left or right uh, right so uh, I have uh, the red at the right I will choose this style and color red apply here and I will choose uh, this style for example and the blue color and apply it here now I will click on OK I applied now I still have the shading for the shading I go to border and shading shading I choose the color I choose the pattern and click on OK and uh, now I applied the shading I can choose the shading again from here border and shading I will search at shading I will choose more uh, color now I applied word example and samples with shading uh, now here I have to merge four cells so I will merge the four cells and university workshop at the bottom uh, right and I will change this border and this border so I will go to here I will merge these four cells uh, I will type uh, university university workshop I will make it at bottom left bottom right I line bold now I will go again to design border and shading I will apply uh, as in the pictures red at the right and single wave at the bottom so I need to apply to cell uh, I will choose this color and red apply to the right this color and uh, this is style is waved and this color at the bottom okay I applied now university workshop I did finally I still have to add uh, here 
uh, for this cell word exam with uh, single border at the top and this border at the right uh, so I will go to this cell here I have word exam I will make it uh, the alignment at the center I will increase the size I will increase the size of word exam uh, now uh, I have to add a highlight as you see in the picture I have a highlight I will add the highlight uh, it is bold uh, now uh, also I have uh, to make it bold uh, finally uh, I need to change the border at the top and the right from here uh, design border uh, and shading at the top I have a single and a blue at the right so at the top uh, I will choose uh, uh, at the top we have a double line double line and at the right we have this style so at the top uh, I will choose the double line with the color apply it to the top and to the left I will choose the style and color and apply it to the uh, to the I need to choose change the color I apply it to the uh, right and uh, I will do it uh, now if I zoom out uh, and uh, for this picture if again I zoomed out I applied this picture in Microsoft Word. Thank you.